two things we know. Childhood mathematics skills are predictive of later mathematics learning and achievement. Two in ten children who start their first year of school behind generally stay behind. As children grow, having good mathematics skills is essential as they're needed for a wide range of activities such as cooking, handling money and budgeting. So when developing these mathematics skills, we know it should begin in infancy and is strengthened during early childhood through their day-to-day activities and play. Not only is there value in the here and now, it also provides good foundation for children's futures. That's why Grace, an early years educator, is participating in the Let's Count program. But what is Let's Count? Let's Count is an early years mathematics program designed and provided by the Smith family. Professor Bob Perry from Charles Sturt University and Associate Professor Anne Gervasoni from Monash University. First, it assists educators to work in partnership with parents and other family members to promote positive mathematics attitudes and experiences for young children aged from three to five. Then, it fosters opportunities between adults and children to engage with the mathematics they encounter as part of their everyday lives and in turn to notice it, explore it and talk about it. Let's Count is based on the principle that children are more likely to have positive experiences of mathematics during their early years if their educators, parents and other family members are also positive about mathematics. Let's Count aligns with the Australian Early Years Learning Framework as it provides grace with the skills and resources to facilitate children's learning in several areas. Let's Count is a fully evaluated program. Since Grace has participated in Let's Count, she has noticed the positive impact that it's had on the children in her care. Grace can also see the effect it's had on parents and other family members, saying it's enhanced their confidence and strengthened their interest in mathematics. They now have a more positive attitude to it. Let's Count let Grace develop strong partnerships with families so together they could support children to develop appropriate mathematical skills. It's a program proven to work. The Teddy sorting activity was one of the activities measured as part of an evaluation. Children were provided with instructions. Here are four teddy mats. Here are 12 teddies. You are going to put the teddies on the mats so there are the same number of teddies on each mat. How many teddies will you put on each mat? By the end of the program, 61% of the children who were involved in Let's Count were able to successfully complete this task. Prior to the program, only 1% of this group was able to do this and only 31% of the children who did not participate in Let's Count were successful with this task. You can access the full Let's Count evaluation report by going to www.thesmithfamily.com.au. The Let's Count program has been a success for those children and for so many families around Australia. Why not sign up today to do the Let's Count e-learning professional development? As an educator, it will help build on your existing knowledge of early years mathematics, learning and working with families. Let's Count is about you engaging and supporting parents and families to build their own capacity and confidence in using Let's Count to notice, explore and talk about mathematics with their children using everyday activities.